Hello all, Terhi here. Uh, first of all, I'd like to say huge sorry for everyone who saw my last video because the voice on the video was so low. But now we are doing much better, right? Uh, anyway, this is my second layout for Hipke Club with June Kids and today I'm focusing on the project live kit. Uh, I have this beautiful photo from Poland and it goes so well together with one of the project live cards designed by our DT coordinator Kim Watson that I really, really wanted to use it. With this layout we have another uh, kind of un unusual thing uh, I'm doing. I'm starting with the photograph. Uh, I'm usually doing first the uh, background, but as I said, I want to use this Project Life card and the photograph, so this was the base when I started. I just knew that I want um, this photograph and the Project Life card next to each other. So I started to make some layers of them. I added some frames and then again some other other frames. Uh, all the papers are from June Paper Kit. Um, and uh, most of them are also designed by Kim Watson. And I really like the color scheme because it's so so springy, so summer, so so nice. And the yellow flowers in my photograph goes so well uh, with these papers. Also the blue sky. It was so beautiful out there. I, I really hope to go go back someday. Anyway, uh, as you see I'm doing some layers um, next to my photograph and now I'm thinking where to put the, the photograph and I want to uh, give full focus for the project lifeguard and for the pro photograph so uh, adding it uh, to the top center of the page. I added some doodling and then I'm stamping with turquoise uh, turquoise ink <laughs> I can't speak anymore. Uh, anyway uh, I added some uh, some ink randomly because I want to have this uh, stamp pattern um, uneven. I want to just add some there and some here. Uh, and I'm using baby wipe to clean the stamp. I don't know which are you using for cleaning your stamp, but I, I think baby wipes are doing the best result. And they dry really fast. Anyway, I'm always saying anyway. So, let's continue. Uh, now I'm using our color kit from June. Uh, we had this amazingly beautiful cloud stencil, also designed by Kim Watson. Uh, and I'm adding these huge clouds um, here and there. Now I really know where my paper uh, layers are going to be, so it's really easy to add just part of the cloud. Not that I want to save my paste from the color kit, well, of course I do. But also, I don't need to add it any 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 more there. So once the clouds are dry, I'm adding some drops of mist. Uh, the blue mist is also from the June color kit, which was really nice again <laughs> because we had this paste, we have this mist, and we have the stencil, and you can do so many things with the stencil, and with mist, and with the paste. Anyway, again, anyway, I'm so sorry for repeating the word anyway. So, um, now I'm thinking about embellishing the layout. And as we have these exclusive, uh, exclusive stickers, I'm thinking of using them and the flower paper. But then again, it, I don't want to cover the photo. Not, no, 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 no because I really want to highlight the photo. So I need to add my embellishments uh, all over and not on top. I usually add some kind of title on top of the picture, but this time I can't do it. So I got an idea to add some figures, which are also our HipKit exclusive uh, figures. These are from uh, Pinkfresh Studio, or Pinkfresh Studio has 
has done them, but these are designed by Hip Hip Hop. So I'm adding the tickers on top of my project lifeguard. Uh, you can get the idea of the text which is um, on the card and still I can add my title on top. It's quite clever, I think. So next I'm adding some more blue because the title is really dark blue and my mist is blue so I want to add some blue. Uh, I'm not adding on top of the picture again, nothing there because I want to see the beautiful Polish mountains all over. So I'm adding these uh, adhesive sequins all over and then I'm adding more mists. This mist is another mist with which was a little bit lighter blue and once the mist mists <laughs> are dry I'm adding some watercolor. Uh, the paste on the color kit which I used to make the clouds is quite um, light. It would done better uh, in some kind of darker background. I think my next layout will be like that. I will use it on some kind of darker uh, paper or something. So I'm adding some yellow watercolor on top of the clouds and then some green here and there. See? It turned out quite nice and the colors are matching quite perfectly for the picture and for the project life. I hope you enjoyed this one because I really did so. Uh, thank you for watching and we'll see you again next week. Bye!